Well, the mild weather we had during the winter certainly enjoyed by a lot of people, but now it looks like we may have to pay a price as we head through the spring, specifically when it comes to ticks. News 8's Renee Schmiel joins us live with the explanation. Renee. Brian, though it has been chilly lately, overall this winter has been one of the warmest on record. And typically, the warmer the winter, the worse the tick season, unfortunately. And officials are already seeing signs that it could be a bad one. Connecticut's Agricultural Experiment Station has been testing several times more ticks this March than it has at this time of year in previous years. In past winters, the lab received one or two ticks per day to test, but this year, on some days, it's gotten dozens. Officials say they're seeing more ticks testing positive for the bacteria that can cause Lyme disease than usual. The bacteria can be transmitted to people through tick bites. In addition to the milder winters, experts blame a large population of white-footed mice, which can carry the Lyme disease bacteria and spread it to the bugs. So what can you do to protect yourself? Well, wear insect repellent, and if you spend some time outdoors, check yourself. Also check your kids and your pets when they come in. Inside. Reporting live, Renee Schmiel, News 8.